I'm just hearing from a very high level government source telling me that it's done. It's done. He needed a final push, push rather, but it is done. Come back to you in just a second, Rory, your thoughts on that. that well, it sounds like it's all over, Kay. If you're hearing it from someone very senior in the government that it's all over, I think that is very much what we were expecting and what has been looking inevitable over the past few hours. If it seemed yesterday that Boris Johnson thought he could carry on and get new people in his top team, it's become incredibly evident this morning with the departures of more key cabinet ministers, other cabinet ministers making clear that they won't desert their posts for national security reasons, but urging the prime minister to go. It is game over. And it sounds from what you're saying and from what we're hearing from others in Downing Street as if the prime minister is now preparing for that and will be uh, preparing to go in the coming hours. OK, what that, what's that going to look like? Well, come out and tell us. Once it is confirmed, we have not had official confirmation of that from Downing Street. It's just what we're hearing. But if it happens, it will involve, I'm sure, as we have seen with previous prime ministers, the lectern coming out and the prime minister addressing everybody who's here. There's a lot of people here in the street, as we saw with David Cameron of the morning after the referendum when he resigned. Remember, he did that little hum that little tune to himself and later said it was to stop him becoming too emotional. Theresa May resigned and we may well see Boris Johnson resign in the coming hours. Now, my understanding is that uh, the Prime Minister did not want to uh, sign any resignation letter, um, but he has been pushed and pushed and pushed this morning uh, by some of his most senior colleagues. And then just a few moments ago, we heard from the Chancellor. We did. We are now... We can now tell you that we expect, Sky News expects Boris Johnson to resign today, to resign in the coming hours. Final straws were the departure of his very loyal Northern Ireland secretary and then the Chancellor, who has been in post for 36 hours, who we heard had told the Prime Minister the game was up yesterday afternoon, publicly saying the Prime Minister must go, the government has lost integrity.